Is this all that you dreamed it be? Ending up here, ending up with me You could have gone anywhere, been anyone You stole my heart like a thief on the run This is Yosemite Lakes Thousand Trails Campground just outside of Yosemite National Park. It's a fairly decent campground. I noticed on the back of the pamphlet they gave us it was voted one of 2020's best campgrounds. They have and it's just a few minutes outside the national park, so its location is really good. And a few sites up on the hill there. And then we'll do a quick drive through and show you some of the sites down around the camping area and the main two main loops. This is one of the main loops campsites along here these are alternate rigs you face one rig faces one way and one rig faces the other and they kind of got buddy pedestals in between them We're camped out in this section of the campground. You can get um, satellite service. If you have a satellite, you can get TV. At least with DISH, you can. There's restrooms there. And then this section is more wooded, so I don't know that you'd be able to get your TV signal down here, but they're, they're riverfront. So you've got the river that runs along behind these sites down here. Some of them are pretty, pretty decent sites. And then they also have them on the other side of the road from the river as well. sure how many 
campsites there is total, but there's a lot in here. Our campsite is number 171, and then here's the some of the cabins they have. They look like pretty nice little cabins. They all seem to come with a grill in front for you to use. And then they got satellites in the back. There's a Wi-Fi tower there if you want to pay for the Wi-Fi for the week. is Yosemite Lakes Thousand Trails Campground. We are getting ready to enter Yosemite National Park. So as you first come into the park, this is where you get your first glimpse of El Capitan and Half Dome. Very, very, very panoramic, nice view. Views here are just breathtaking. The river down there. First of the big waterfalls when you come into the park from the west entrance like we did. I'm not sure what the name of it is. It goes there goes under the bridge we're on and it continues right down there goes all the way down around the corner and down into the valley down below where it runs into the Merced River that is Bridal Vale Falls And there's a waterfall there too. However, we do not know what that one is called. Beautiful here though. And that is El Capitan, one of the two main rock formations in the park. That is Upper Yosemite Falls. So that is El Capitan. And then if we ride around here, I don't know, maybe you can see it way off there in the distance, is Horsetail Falls. You get a beautiful view. And that is Yosemite Falls, Upper Falls. And then you can't see it from here, but there's a middle section and a lower section as well. Oh. 
more video of Yosemite Falls, Upper Falls. Now we got the nice river here. Yosemite Valley. Another river, rest of the valley. Upper Yosemite Falls from the floor of Yosemite Valley. They have tent camping sites, campgrounds in Yosemite Falls. Bridal Vale Falls from across the Merced River. All the big granite peaks on both sides. Still some snow up there. Fred dropped me off. He's going to go drive around the loop. And I thought I'd get a few pictures out here walking across the dam. Raining a little bit. But it sure is pretty. Wish it was a better day.
had to come over and see what's in the tunnel. Oh, you can walk all the way through. Well, Fred's waiting for me, so I think I'll go back. Yosemite Lakes. from Tunnel Dome, Tunnel View, when you first come out of the tunnel on Highway 41. You get a view of the valley with Bridalville Falls over there. There we go. That is about the best view of El Capitan you're going to get from anywhere in the park. Driving down the one lane road, shooting out of the top of the Jeep with the tops off. What a view of El Capitan. Hopefully the video does it justice of just how big a chunk of granite that is. And so with this ends our time in Yosemite National Park for this trip. But we will be back because there were some things closed that we didn't get to see.